Hi everyone, I'm Vanessa Alzate, the owner and CEO of Kirkpatrick Partners. I know there's been a lot of changes that have been happening to Kirkpatrick, and I am here to give you a little bit more of an insight into what we've been working on behind the scenes and what's coming down the pipe in just a very few short months. But first and foremost, I wanna give you a little bit more of an introduction of who I am, like who is Vanessa Alzate that now owns Kirkpatrick Partners? Well, I'm also the founder and CEO of Anchored Training. And Anchored Training is an instructional design agency that works with organizations to create instructor-led training, e-learning, you know, help them map out and do analysis and blueprints and all the things. And we do staff augmentation as well. Um, and so Anchored Training is, you know, it's my first love, my first baby, but in, I say around December of last year, I started thinking about how to expand the brand even further. I got started um, with Anchored in 2018 um, and rapidly grew the brand through the pandemic. Um, and I, I was looking for that next level, the next step for myself, the business, and really looking at the world of learning and development. And as I thought more into, you know, what I wanted to see for my future, what I wanted to see for the future of employee learning and performance, I wanted to create a network, a network of brands that could come together um, and support um, organizations and advancing their missions and helping them achieve great workplace cultures. Um, and really, you know, for me, for all organizations, like your benefits are your benefits and those are all great and you know, you have to have good benefits. But the one thing that I think we can all rely on and that is consistent no matter if you are 18 years old or 108 years old, we all want to learn and grow, whether it's within our role, whether it's to move up, whether it's to move out. Um, and for me, the heart and the hub of every organization is learning and development. Um, or learning and performance. And I wanted to create a network of brands that help to support that and be complementary services to each other. Um, and in around May of 2023 is when I found out um, more that I could purchase the Kirkpatrick brand. Um, and I was beside myself. And it was, I think, 11 o'clock at night, and I freaked out when I saw I had the possibility um, of being part of this legacy. And for me, you know, Kirkpat the Kirkpatrick model and the Kirkpatrick brand was so paramount to myself. You know, I got started learning development in 2009. And when I was learning more about instructional design and learning and the ADDI model and evaluation, I was following and learning more about you know, the Kirkpatrick methodology. You know, I bought the books and I, you know, created processes and anchored that are rooted in the Kirkpatrick model and, you know, really uh, supported by the Kirkpatrick model. So to have this as part of that bigger umbrella network um, was so surreal. And I'm just so honored um, that Wendy and Jim chose me to, um, to be part of that legacy and to move the brand into to the future. You know, I see Kirkpatrick beyond the Kirkpatricks. You know, I see Kirkpatrick as all of you. I see Kirkpatrick as all of us. You know, um, it's something that is rooted in learning and evaluation. It's something that's rooted in instructional design. And I think we all have um, the ability to help move it into the future and uh, expand upon it and really enhance it and honor um you know what don got started back in 1954 so i couldn't be more thrilled um, and humbled and honored to be in this position so really the goods what you want to know since coming into uh, my full-time position here at Kirkpatrick Partners, I've been learning the brand, learning the business, and seeing all of the behind the scenes. I'm actually filming right now in our office in Noonan, Georgia. Um, so I've been working through team enhancements, process enhancements, automation of our processes, um, and just you know really putting our folks in positions where they're working in their zone of genius and working in their zones of excellence, um, and really just ensuring that we are enhancing our experience so that the experience that we're providing 
to our customers, all of you, is a wow experience. So you're going to start to see, you know, as you uh, go into our programs and interact with our team members, um, you start to see some of those enhancements and enhanced customer service, which we're really excited about. I've also been spending the last few weeks uh, talking with customers, talking with potential customers, um, talking with past customers, as well as facilitators, our affiliate brands, uh, students, observing programs, watching recordings, and just getting an overall sense um, of you know where everyone was, where, what they wanted from the brand, what they really craved more of, um, what they loved of, about it, and what they wanted to keep, um, what they would love to enhance, and really just doing a lot of listening and a lot of observing. And from this, my vision of what we're internally calling Kirkpatrick 3.0 is coming to fruition. So we started with, or are starting with, a full visual rebrand and redesign. So over the next few weeks, you'll start to see some new elements. Um, you'll start to see our new logo and our new brand, our new color schemes, honoring the colors and the schemes and the, and the color schemes and the brand of the past, um, but just elevating a little bit of the experience and then you know, pretty soon thereafter, you'll see a new website um, and some new technologies and whatnot. Along with a full visual redesign of the brand, we're also working on our marketing and sales outreach and strategy. Um, and we're working on ensuring that the business is um, registered as a woman and minority owned business, um, as well as getting our products and services on the GSA schedule to support so many of our government and military customers. But more importantly, we are working on updating our bronze and silver program materials. So we're, we listened to a lot of the feedback we got from customers and students and our facilitators and affiliates and are creating a more collaborative um, experience for our students um, and one in which they can actually walk away with the plan that they can um, actually start to implement um, and get that support with implementation through the silver program. And one in which we're, you know, you have the facilitator that can help provide feedback on it um, and just really do more collaboration and build more of a Kirkpatrick community. You know, we worked through um, when I first uh, got on board, you know, our core values at Kirkpatrick and one of those um, core values for us is inclusion, you know, and really is um, the the idea of community and bringing folks together, um, you know, allowing them to show up as as they are and be met where they're at, um, but be part of that that larger Kirkpatrick community. And that all starts with our certification programs. We're also working on new products. So not in the very distant future. Um, so pretty soon you will see some new products, um, some toolkits. We wanted to have a product that could be for anyone, maybe someone that couldn't go through our certification program just yet, but really wanted to get a little bit of a taste of Kirkpatrick and start off with some of the tools. So um, some of those products will be coming out in the very near future. And we are so excited to be celebrating 70, yes, 70, 70 years of Kirkpatrick in 2024. We are already planning for a year-long celebration, um, our platinum celebration of the model, and we're working on a really amazing way to celebrate in June of 2024. So make sure you keep June 2024 on your calendar and you subscribe to all the things, um, LinkedIn, our YouTube, our newsletter, so that you hear first when we launch what is coming in June. You are not going to want to miss the celebration. And last, but certainly not least, we are going to be launching a Kirkpatrick podcast. So we know that there are questions you all have and you want to hear more from Jim and from, you know, other participants of the program, from some of our customers of how they're actually implementing the Kirkpatrick model at their organization. And this is going to be our opportunity to share that with you. So we'll have an audio podcast so you can subscribe to it on any of your favorite podcasting platforms, as well as a video companion podcast where um, you can uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel and watch Jim and I uh, talk more about the Kirkpatrick model and speak with um, past uh, students, current customers, and you know really hear more from the community about um, how the Kirkpatrick model has, you know, really for some folks changed our life and changed our organization. And look, I understand that change can be unsettling and change can make folks nervous. And I am here to assure you that the Kirkpatrick brand and everything that it has stood for 
is still going to stand the test of time and is not the essence of the brand is not changing. What we are doing is taking the Kirkpatrick model, the Kirkpatrick methodology and all the good work that Dom, Jim and Wendy have done and enhance it for the future and really help to build that community and give the folks what they want and give, give you all the ability to apply the Kirkpatrick model at your own organization um, and see how it could be so vastly applied. One of the things I love so much about the model is the simplicity of it. You know, it's four levels. You know, once you really have that, once you hear Jim really speak about uh, level four and level three, it makes everything else make perfect sense. Um, and it's something that can be applied, not just in learning and development, not just to training, but so many different areas of the business. And that's what I love so much about it too. It's, it's not just a model about training or learning. It's a model that you can then apply and touch so many facets of the business and they can feel part of, um, the Kirkpatrick program, they can feel like it's it's more of a holistic solution. So uh, I'm excited to, to be able to bring that um, into the future as well. So no worries, the model that you know and love um, is certainly here to stay and will certainly be um, one that we honor the legacy of it um, and enhance for the future. Our team, our expertise, and our commitment to you is truly unwavering. We are here as always to support your success. We are ready to listen and eager to meet your expectations. Kirkpatrick 3.0, as we're calling it, is truly here just to help empower you. Empower you with the tools, the knowledge, and the skills you need to apply the model at your organization and give you more opportunities to achieve extraordinary results. Together, we're stepping into a future full of opportunities. Your trust, partnership, and success are cornerstones of our journey ahead. I am immensely excited and deeply honored to embark on this transformational journey with you. I would love to hear from all of you. If you have any questions for Jim and I to answer on the podcast, so please let us know. Do not hesitate to reach out to me or the team at any time. And please be sure to connect with me on LinkedIn. Thank you, and here's to the next chapter of innovation, excellence, and unparalleled success.